Welcome back here watching Storyboard. This week Facebook India launched Thumb Stoppers, a first of its kind initiative to redefine short form mobile video creativity in the country. This initiative is in partnership with leaders from the advertising industry and the aim is to transform storytelling for mobile advertising. Facebook recognizes that mobile has fundamentally reshaped consumer behavior. With declining attention spans, one just has a precious few seconds to get the consumer attention as traditional advertising formats of 60 seconds and 30 seconds don't work well on the mobile. The industry needs to embrace the possibility that stories can be told in under 10 seconds. That's the premise of Thumb Stoppers. Short stories move hearts. To find out more about this campaign, I caught up with Sandeep Bhushan, Head of Global Marketing Solutions Facebook India on the sidelines of the campaign launch event. To tell us more about this initiative, we have Sandeep Bhushan. Head of India GMS Facebook, Sandeep, welcome to Storyboard. Thank you. Uh, so tell us uh, more about uh, Facebook Thumbstoppers campaign. How did you arrive upon the concept? Uh, what was the initial idea like and uh, what exactly are you guys doing? So I think a couple of uh, key movements in the world around us. Uh, consumers are on mobile, uh, consumers are on internet. Uh, India, we're talking of half a billion uh, consumers now on the internet. Uh, and the way they access the internet is very different from what the expectation is. Um, they stroll fast, they like to discover information, they like to build communities, but they certainly like to seek value out of every interaction. The question is, what is the right way, therefore, to communicate uh, on the mobile platforms to get the message across? Uh, business results, specifically, for example, in the context of your audience, uh, have been a key theme of how Facebook engages with uh, the businesses. So from the smallest business uh, to the largest multinationals, we've been partnering businesses in moving business results. The question further is, what is the right kind of content that can power it even further? We now know that consumers move fast on the feed and also assimilate information faster. What is the right creative storytelling, therefore for mobile, is the question in front of all of us. And what we're launching today uh, is an initiative to partner industry to bring the best CCOs together to consider what needs to be done. Mm -hmm. And we're putting out a program called Facebook Thumbstoppers, a multi-part activity to get the right uh, creative on mobile, emotional stories that can be told in under 10 seconds, and we call it Thumbstoppers. Okay, because typically when we uh, used to see on Facebook was like uh, the longer format of the shorter television ad, because te television, of course, is very expensive. So the longer format used to be played on Facebook as a, yes. as a platform. So did you look at it as uh, like something that you guys want to change for brands to yes. make it more yes. engaging for yes. their consumers? Yes. The savviest marketers across the world are already building for the feed, which is for a consumer who's browsing through the feed and making choices on what content to engage with. Remember, every piece of communication is competing with the consumer's interest, which could be around a community that he or she's part of, uh, around a cause he or she's part of, around news that he or she wants to consume, or uh, take brand messaging. This is a competitive set, and we cannot deny this uh, situation. The best marketers are already building for the feed, which is what can we deliver quickly in terms of both our branding and our message. Okay. So what we're we pushing for, yeah. uh, just building on that further, yeah. what we're pushing for now is an industry-wide set of practices to institutionalize this way of working and addressing the very specific question uh, that can storytelling in under 10 seconds move hearts? Yeah. Can we tell emotional stories? And we certainly think so. So okay. that's the program. So as you said, you certainly think so. And you know, a lot of, I'm sure a lot of marketers and brands would wonder how could they uh, possibly tell their brand story or whatever they are trying to say within 10 seconds. But you demonstrated that in your presentation. Uh, tell us more about those films and you know, how did you uh, manage those films within 10 seconds? Yeah. And in fact, you yeah. mentioned 9.99 seconds, yeah. right? Yes. Uh, so again, great work on 
Facebook, on Instagram, globally is happening and it works uh, under 10 seconds. Um, the question is, can we institutionalize it? Mm -hmm. So we went to our creative agency, in this case, Wonderman Thompson, and said, hey, can you help us put a module together that makes the point sharper? While, of course, many businesses uh, and fantastic business partners are already doing it. So for the purpose of this program, we put out special films that make the point also specifically around whatever be your cause. And you saw that we are looking at those causes under four categories, all the way from human behavior you want to change to brands that consumers love. Yeah. So whatever be your case, communication can move hearts for consumers on mobile is our thesis. So how soon do you think brands uh, should start moving to a shorter story format as compared to what they are doing right now? So the best brands already do it. Uh, the best agencies are already doing it. The question is, can everyone do it? Because every minute of the consumer is valuable and every dollar spent of commu on communication advertising is valuable. How do we make sure we don't waste a second in storytelling or a dollar in advertising spend? And that's the effort. And therefore, it's urgent. By the way, it's required as of yesterday because we know the scale of the consumers on our platforms globally. Okay, so but why, can't, why uh, don't you think that a brand uh, can't trim a longer uh, commercial into a shorter 10-second format? Because already uh, that consumer might be exposed to it on different platforms. So why can't a brand just trim it down and yes. put it to... Ha they have the context. Yes. So they can just yes. Yes. view it in a shorter format on Facebook. Why not? I think the history of media tells us how the transitions have always been in taking from a medium for another. I think the uh, anecdote that's, uh, that stands out always is how radio advertising moved to television. And it was actually radio advertising read out on television when TV happened, I think, 70, 80 years ago. Should we be repeating the same mistake again, which is take the television ad and put it where the reveal of the brand is in the 30th second and the consumers moved on? Yeah. So it is suboptimal. Question is... Can creative agencies, when given the right framework, build? Of course they can. They build today for newspaper, hmm. and they build today for TV, hmm. as they will build tomorrow for the feed. The question, therefore, is the moment the best creative minds know the framework, they are able to produce content, because hmm. they are in the business of telling emotional stories, whatever be the medium. The question is, can we agree with what is that set of constraints, and what is that opportunity? And the effort now uh, is in two parts, therefore. One is to inspire, where um, we will ask the best creative minds to write creatives that we're going to therefore take forward in showcasing. Uh, and before that, to engage, which is take to every single agency in the country these rules and these opportunities that allow them the freedom to create for emotion. Sandeep, why do you think a consumer will watch a shorter story, a shorter 10-seconder on Facebook as compared to a longer story? I think consumer attention deserves... Uh, to be one, especially if it's a commercial message. The consumer did not start by saying, today I want a commercial message, right? Um, CRM products, for example, uh, on many platforms where a consumer-initiated journey happens is a different scenario. For example, on our messaging apps, today you can ask a question, get a response, whether it's with an automated bot or directly from the business on the other side. But when a consumer is not initiating a query, typically we have to work hard to win the attention of the consumer uh, and therefore, that is the opportunity. The shorter the attention that the consumer wants to give to advertising, the harder we have to work to make sure that we get the attention, except we need to know how to. Okay, that's a great thought. In fact, the shorter the attention that consumers give to a story, the harder we have to work. Sandeep, thank you so much. Thanks for speaking to us. Thank you. This discussion will continue. Coming up next week, we have a special episode. Storyboard presents Facebook Thumb Stoppers, Short Stories Move Hearts. It will carry forward this discussion on storytelling under 10 seconds. It is time for us to slip into a short break. On the other side of this break, we catch up with Pekka Rantala, Executive Vice President and Chief Marketing Officer, h &D Global, on the company's global plans for brand Nokia and how they are planning to to revive its legacy.